The reaction to this news has been pouring in all afternoon and all evening. With more reaction, here is 11 Alive's Liza Lucas. We've been watching as an overwhelming love for the former president and an appreciation for his life of service has been all over social media. Following the news, he will start hospice care. Senator Jason Carter sharing some insight from the family, writing online that he saw both of his grandparents yesterday. He says, quote, they are at peace and as always, their home is full of love. The kind words and wishes continuing across Georgia. Governor Brian Kemp says his family is praying for the former president and first lady asking all across the state to do the same. And U.S. Senator Raphael Warnock shared similar sentiments, referencing President Carter's strong faith and giving a nod to the seasons of life. Many of those seasons spent in serving others. The leader of Habitat Humanity sharing a statement writing that all of us are lifting up President and Mrs. Carter in prayer. This man moves humanity forward every single day, wrote Maria Shriver, one of the countless people joining online to pay tribute and reflect. We understand that President Biden this evening is aware of former President Carter's decision to begin hospice care, and the White House is also in touch with the Carter family. All right, we'll have the very latest details for you as we hear them as they relate to President Carter. For the latest, you can head over to 11alive.com.